Hello everybody. As I promised on the Facebook, as usual, I uh, will gonna make this uh, video about uh, your face mask and what the face mask is and where are the face mask coming from and uh, uh, most important, how to find your power to let go of that face mask. Um, first of all, I want to begin with the very first uh, part. When you're born, uh, even as a child, uh, as a baby, as a kid, uh, you start to be programmed how to fit in the, in the world, in the society, how to fit on the base of uh, where you're born, how to be, how to react, and what you need to be according to others but not according to your, your own self. So, parents, teachers, friends, lovers, everybody have this part of building your, uh, your face mask. Uh, even at the beginning, if you didn't listen, your parents, uh, they tried to punish you for some reason. Your teacher, if you don't listen, or if you don't do your study, you got the bad grades. At church, probably, if you didn't behave, uh, you were taught like you should obey God. Um, you were probably doing at uh, the high school, you start having uh, uh, more serious relationships. And during that uh, part of during those relationships, uh, the people you start having the relationships with, uh, they affect you like uh, they like uh, look at you. You should not react this like me. You should can just abandon me like this. You should have could have, and that should have could have have a, this reaction over the people to. Well, if I want to have a boyfriend, maybe I should not do this. Maybe I should not be myself. I should have to be acting like that. And that also helps to create this uh, false image of yourself that you're presenting to others. Just so you can fit to the society. Just so you can satisfy others. So, you can live a life full of lies in front of everybody, including yourself. Until one day you are waking up and you are like, I want to be happy. What's wrong with me? Why am I not happy? And you start having those uh, self-conversations with yourself. And you're doing this self-realization. And when you do this self-realization, you awaken. And you become more awakened and more awakened. And you understand that uh, there is some things that happen inside of you. Or something else going on inside of you. That you are made uh, for different purpose. Not to living a lie. And specifically, you lie in yourself. And as a soul, once you awaken, you understand that uh, you have uh, so many things inside of you. You understand that uh, you have a soul, you have a higher self, you have a shadow, a things that you hide from anything and everyone. And you have this face mask. The one that uh, you show up to everybody else. You go to work, you smile. And inside everything else is crying. But you smile. You go back home and you probably see your husband or wife. How was your day, honey? What's good? You all know what I'm talking about. 
until one day you throw that past face mask away and you show up your true self. And a lot of people start, oh my gosh, what happened to you? What thing did you smoke? What thing did you do? And you're like, no, I always been like this. You just never knew it. What? Yeah. I just never show you my true self. You still love me? Most of people will not figure that part out. Most of people will not understand you at this point. And most of the people, they're going to do one thing. They're going to leave you. Simply because they cannot handle your real you. And as a society, uh, we've been taught early in age to have this face mask. So the society can accept us. The society programming us. The school programming us. The religion programming us. Doesn't matter what religion you take. Every religion has its limits. Outside of these limits of the religion, well, they cannot give you the explanation. Doesn't matter what religion you take. And that's, that's, that's sometimes um, i talking about people who get into the twin flame relationship. Uh, Religion doesn't matter. But the only thing that matters is love within the soul. And when that thing kicks in, uh, you start evolving. And that evolution doesn't care what religion you are. You're a Christian, you're a Muslim, you're a Jew, you're a Buddhism, you're spirituality. That doesn't ask you. Are you born rich? Or are you born poor? You born in Russia, you born in the United States, you born in Japan, or you born in Australia or Zimbabwe. That was not a question you're gonna ask. You are asking you to be your true self, you to be yourself. And when you find that part, you find out the mask that you've been living. This is like uh, awakening of uh, Neo within the Matrix. You look at the society, you look at everything else, and when they told you following the white rabbit, and you follow the white rabbit, you get an awaken, and once you awaken, red pill or the blue pill, each one is gonna be. And uh, are you gonna throw your face mask and become real you or you're gonna go back to the shadow and the society and put your face mask on a lot of the people in order to survive to keep their survival they hold into their mask for years and years to keep their image to keep their family image to keep uh, because of the support of uh, the spouse, because of finances, or because they have a kids. And uh, they find themselves throughout the years that uh, at some point they're like, yeah, I live a life of a lie, but it was a good lie because I protect my family. I sacrifice myself for the family. I sacrifice myself for uh, living for the others, but I don't live for myself. And the people who throw in that uh, face mask off, they basically says, I'm gonna live in my truth. I'm here to live a happy life. I'm here to show others that the face mask, it's a false, it's a false life, it's a false belief system, and it's more important for me to show the others 
that there is a love and it's more important to me to show that I can be happy and it's more important to me not to lie not only myself but others and to be example of how not to lie and live my true life and even that power start empowering the soul start empowering this uh, soul inside of you that uh, nothing uh, can actually stand away um, borders religions cultures age uh, there was just a, a lady that uh, she posted uh, on a facebook that she's been four years together with her lover she's 34 he's 62 and by her words i want to say something that uh, by her words of expression she said one thing I feel like I live 30 years with this man. I know him so well as he knows me so well. And now I understand that age is just a number. And this is how this woman living her true self. This is not someone who just go out and say things this is someone who throwing her uh, face mask off and it says hey I'm gonna live in my true self um, personal for me that was uh, when I uh, throw the face mask off and I said hey I am twin flame I'm gonna go out in public and I'm gonna say I am twin flame because that is the truth that is the living truth for myself I am what I am and everybody else who were out there who did the same thing uh, they did a very very courageous thing to take the mask off and says I am I'm so grateful for my uh, soul partner. She throw the face, the her face mask off, and is like, "Hey, I am in a relationship with you." Because a lot of the people they see that face mask that was uh, with so many layers, and they didn't see uh, the real part that was underneath and most of the time when you throw that mask off yes there will be people that's not gonna like you because simply you are new evolve you you evolve in yourself at all the time and when you evolve people are gonna still like that face mask people's gonna still hanging on to that face mask you are but the real people that were gonna love you for your face mask, for your shadow, for your ego, for your inner self, as a soul. They're gonna love the whole thing, not just one thing they like. And the part of the love is that once you take care of this face mask off, you expose yourself in the shadow and that shadow is the things that you hide in yourself I want to be talking more on the new video on it I'm probably gonna make it in the next few days about the shadow but again it's you to take the courage to take this uh, face mask off and start showing yourself out in the world who you are why did you came here for how to live your true self and how to become what you your real you want to become 
Thank you so much for this video. I'm looking forward for your comments. Be loved.